In this given problem, we are provided with the seconds column and the frequency column. And this table says to us that two people had a race time that falls under 51 to 55, seven people under 56 to 60, eight people in the score of 61 to 65, and four people in the time of 66 to 70. So to solve for the mean of this given problem, we still need to compute for our or we need to build our frequency table. So that is seconds, or we need to place here the class interval. We also have the corresponding frequency, x, and f times x. So in our class interval, we need to separate our limits. So for our lower limits, it's 51. For upper limit, it's 55. Now, to make it easier for us, we just place here equal a2 plus 5 and then we drag it down and it's the same for this plus 5 then we drag it down now we have completed the seconds column we now go to the frequency we just need to copy it so 2 7 8 and 4 the x is the midpoint of this limits so it is equal to 51 plus 55 divided by 2. Then we drag it down. We now have the midpoint for each row. So the f times x is equal to 2 times 53. It is equal to 106. We drag it down. Now we have f times x of each row. For the summation of f, we need to place here sum. Select everything press enter, we have 21, and then we drag it to the right. We now have the summation of f times x and summation of f. We deleted summation of x because we don't need it. Now the mean is the summation of f times x, so we click this, divided by summation of f. So we have e6 divided by c6. We now have a mean of 61.33. But in reality, this is mean is actually just estimated. We don't know the real scores of the people who participated in this race. We just know that two people had a race time under 55 to 55. We Seven people timed from 56 to 60. Eight from 61 to 65. Four people from 66 to 70. But we don't know their real scores. So we can only call this value as the estimated mean. So in our next video, we will be computing for our estimated median and for our estimated mode. So to end, just note that if we are given intervals and not the real scores of the people who participated in it, then we are only computing for the estimated mean. If you have questions, Ask me on the comment section.